The accountants in Biley v. Arthur Young & Company issued unqualified or clean audit opinions on a rising computer company's financial statements. As it turned out, the financial statements understated the company's liabilities by about $3 million. Non-client investors who relied on the audit opinions to their detriment filed suit. But could the investors recover from the negligent accountants? Osborne Computer Corporation was a pioneer in the portable computer market and one of the fastest-growing companies in American history. Prior to its initial public offering, or IPO, Osborne hired Arthur Young & Company, one of the big eight accounting firms, to audit its financial statements for the past two years. Arthur Young ultimately issued unqualified audit opinions on the financial statements, prompting Robert Biley and several other non-clients who read the opinions to invest in Osborne. But as it turned out, Osborne's financial statements understated the company's liabilities by about $3 million. The anticipated IPO never happened, and the company filed for bankruptcy in 1983. After losing their investments, Biley and other plaintiffs sued Arthur Young in California State Court. The plaintiffs claimed that they invested in Osborne because of the accountant's audit opinions, which were negligently prepared. The trial court instructed the jury on general professional negligence, and the jury found for the plaintiffs. The California Court of Appeal affirmed, and Arthur Young appealed to the California Supreme Court.